Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm bringing you this how to apply eyelashes for dummies tutorial. I'm not calling you a dummy if you don't know how to apply eyelashes. This is just a tutorial that I've tried to make as easy as possible giving you all my tips on how to apply eyelashes because I know they can be annoying sometimes. So this is just what I find works best. So yeah, let's jump right into it then. I'm mid-tutorial on another tutorial, so that's why I look scald these past no remarks than me up there. So first off, how you apply your eyelashes all depends on the type of eyelash that you're using. The Lily Lashes Foam Mink Delara. These are them here. These are the lashes here, so they have got quite a thick band. The thicker the band is, the harder the lash is to work with. So if you are working with something that has got quite a thick band, what you want to do is get your tweezers or your fingers and run the lash like so. Really just making the band a lot more flexible and bendable. It just means when it's sitting on your eye then it's not going to be poking into you and it's going to be a lot easier to apply it also. Then what you want to do is you actually want to measure your eyelash. Now I have mine measured already but if you are measuring your eyelash what you want to do is look down. Don't close your eye. If you close your eye your eye gets smaller and you're going to end up cutting off too much. So look down into the mirror or else get your client to look down. Place the eyelash on top of your eye lift it off, see how much extra was hanging off and then cut it. I want to make sure that you cut from the outer part of the eyelash and not the inner corner. As you can see the lashes that I'm working with are tapered, that means that they're shorter at the inner corner and longer at the outer edge. Those are typically the type of lashes I like to go for, especially with winged out looks. You want to make sure you cut off from the outer edge and not the inner part, otherwise you're going to get rid of the lovely taperedness and you're just going to end up with a more rounded eyelash. You're happy enough with the flexibility of the lash and the length of the lash you're going to want to apply your glue. So today I am using the black duo glue because I have got a black liner on my lid. So the glue I typically use it so did you what? So the glue I typically use is the duo glue. I find it works great for me. There's the the black one and the clear one. I'm using the black one today because I have a black liner and it's going to dry black and just blend in better. The black one is waterproof, so if you're someone who suffers from leaky eye a lot, it works a little bit better for you. The only thing is it does dry black, so if you get it on your eyeshadow, it's going to create like a little black dot. But what you do is just don't touch it, wait for it to dry, and once it's dry, you can just pick it off. Can't use this if you're going for a look where you don't have the liner on though because it dries black it's going to create like a little bumpy ridge so that's the black one and then the white one obviously it dries clear it's not waterproof it's great if you're going for a more natural daytime look and are wearing a more natural lash both of these you can get from boots or pennies or somewhere like that so today i've used the black duo glue like i said that's how much i applied there you want to make sure you don't use too much glue otherwise it's not going to dry it's going to take ages to get tacky and for you to apply i do apply a little bit extra to the inner and outer corners because those are the ones that are going to play you i'm not sure you let the glue get tacky so just like wiggle it around for a bit don't blow on it if you're working on someone else you might as well be spitting on their face and that is disgusting just let it get tacky the tackier the glue is the easier it's just gonna stick right on i like to use tweezers it's just what i'm used to using because i have got claws I just think it's a lot easier to use tweezers. So when applying the lash then, again, you wanna make sure you look down into the mirror and don't close your eye. If you close your eye, your eye gets smaller and then whenever you open the lash, it's gonna be lifted off. So I've let my glue get tacky for around 30 seconds. Then what we're gonna do is look down into the mirror, place it onto the outer edge. Stick it onto the outer edge first and then peel it inwards towards the inner corner of the eye. I'm using the tweezers then to make sure that the lash is as close to the lash line as possible. You don't want to have a gap in between your natural lashes and the falsies. This lash is actually very easy to work with. Even though the lashes are quite big and quite thick, the band is still really flexible. So I'm really enjoying these. I think these lashes are a bit more on the expensive side anyway, so they would want to work deadly. And what I do is I just kind of blink onto the lashes to push them up a little bit further if you want them to look a little bit bigger. And that's it. That's literally how easy that was. The most important part is to make sure that the glue gets tacky. If the glue isn't tacky, it's gonna slide all over the place. It's gonna make it so much harder for you to apply the lash. If it's tacky, it's literally just gonna stick right on like what mine did. Now, sometimes the inner corner will stick up, but that's just because it's annoying and wants to just ruin your day. If it's sticking up whenever you first apply your lashes, it just means the inner corner isn't tacky enough yet. So don't keep going in and trying to stick it down straight after each other because you're just gonna irritate your eye. You wanna leave it chill out for 10 seconds or so, just chill, and then just very gently push it 
back in and it should stick. No sweat. That there's a finished tutorial for you guys. I really hope you enjoyed this and learned something from it. I hope it makes your eyelash life a lot easier. Do you know what I think as well, all right? I have absolutely zero, zero eyelashes. So I feel like the eyelashes nearly feel sorry for me and just go on easy for me because they know that I'm lacking an awful lot in that department. I think the fact that I have no eyelashes works with me because it's a lot easier for me to apply them. I don't have any curly natural eyelashes getting in my room. Always see the positive guys. Always see the positive. But yeah, that there's the finished tutorial on applying eyelashes or hopefully makes it a little bit easier for you. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please give it a thumbs up down below and comment any of your friends that might find this tutorial helpful. I have filmed a tutorial on this eye look if any of you want to check it out you can i'll leave it in the description box down below or somewhere up here i haven't figured out how to do that yet so if i have it'll be here if not your girl's still trying all right all right that's all from me don't forget to hit subscribe as well if you haven't already i've got plenty of tutorials over on my page putting a lot more effort into my youtube for you guys since you guys are asking so much and yeah that's all from me then so bye bye